Eddie Hearn on Baumgartner. She has to explain herself in this process. I hope she can prove her innocence. Promoter Eddie Hearn of Matchroom has found himself in the middle of several drug testing scandals in the last 12 months. Hearn is still dealing with the ongoing legal drama surrounding unbeaten welterweight contender Connor Ben, who tested positive in two separate drug tests last year. Two weeks ago, heavyweight Dillian White tested positive for a performance enhancing drug and was immediately removed from a scheduled pay-per-view rematch with Anthony Joshua. And on Wednesday night, it was revealed that undisputed super featherweight champion Alicia Baumgartner had tested positive for two banned substances in connection to her July 15th rematch with Christina in Detroit. Baumgartner, who openly proclaimed her innocence, explained that she came up clean on a test administrated on June 16th and also tested clean on fight night. The positive sample was taken on July 12th. Hearn detailed that his company is investigating more money into drug testing fighters on a more consistent basis and as a result there will be an increase in fighters coming up with adverse tests. I did an interview yesterday and someone said to me obviously a lot of people will point the finger at Matchroom. I said for what? If you want the sport to be a safer sport, I'm not looking for a pat on the back, but you should want as much testing as possible across as many fights as possible in the sport. That's what we are trying to implement and it's not a competition against other professional companies. It's fact that we're it's fact that we're the only professional company investing anywhere near this level into testing to try and make the sport as clean as possible, Eddie Hearn told IFL TV. Alicia Baumgartner, who we've represented for a long time, she had a test on one side of it and she passed, and she had a test a couple of days later on fight night that she passed, but still, she has to explain herself in this process and will support her in this process and I hope that she can prove her innocence here absolutely but we want to make sure that there is as much testing as possible unfortunately this would be the case across the sports if you ramp up the testing and intensify the number of fighters who are being tested on a regular basis you will find more analytical findings. It's simple. So if we didn't do any testing like other promoters, we wouldn't have any cases, but we do. And unfortunately, you go to other main event fighters aren't being attested. Read it again. And unfortunately, you go to other main events, fighters aren't being tested. We're not perfect, but we're trying to continuously invest in testing and there's a lot more to come as well about programs that we're trying to implement to make the sport as safe as possible. This is Fighter Get Knocked Out. Let me know in the comment section what y'all think about Eddie Hearn telling Alicia Baumgartner we want you to explain yourself and all the testing that Matchroom is doing. That's why a lot of fighters is popping dirty right now. This is Fighter Get Knocked Out, ladies and gentlemen. I'm going to be out the building. Have a good one.